Aiden Primo, 23 years of age. His formative years in Voorhees. Of course, his dad, Keith, expected to be here with the police and family as this one is underway. And all the way back. That is that is Probrock just throws it up the middle. Allison will come back to get that. And now Morgan Frost with some room through center. He's by himself, cuts in, holds, spins to the back end. And the save made by Primo. Then between the legs pass to Brendan Lemieux. His keeper bellows for the Flyers, backhanding in. Talked about those injuries in the pregame show. They're closing in on 600 man games lost to injury. Hayes flings that one in on Primo. They've had some pretty good offensive plays. Yeah, that's a little surprising number. Now they move up here with numbers, and here's Suzuki with speed to the back end, and the save by Sandstrom as Suzuki tried to go upstairs. That would be Coetzee, right? Yep. Have everyone believe he's retiring? And he's going to say April Fools as he and gets he's on be the right mic. back out. Here's Hayes moving in. He's got a step, and the save by Primo. Pro Ross pass here, intercepted by Evans. In across the line, getting help now. Evans drops it off. Gallagher, the shot off. Iron up high, and it rang loud and clear. Now Van Riemsdyk ahead. Kovacevic breaks that up. Savard holding on. Cross ice. That shot. The save made by Sandstrom as it deflected high in the air after being hammered in on goal by Belzeal. And out to center goes Lemieux. But he's checked by Bellows. And Cates will move it ahead to Farabee. Farabee hoping Bellows can get free. But he does finally get it to him. And then following up is Sandheim. Checked. No penalty. And the puck cleared all the way down. Apparently a legal play there. Sandheim's not arguing. Yeah, that's another player that John Tortorello really wanted to see step it up down the stretch, and he has done that over the last three or four games. He's got the puck again. Moves it through Farabee and into the Montreal zone. Ristolainen to D'Angelo. Takes a look. Back out Ristolainen. Now deals it for Hayes. Hayes holding on. Around behind the net. Fires are changing up. The pass comes out to Frost. Who scores? Morgan Frost. With a seed, and it's a power play goal. The Flyers take a 1 0 lead as Harvey Pinard limps off the ice. Harvey Pinard was in a ton of pain, was trying to stay in the play, was unable to really help his teammates out. Hayes makes an outstanding pass. Frost with a great shot gets it under the arm there of Caden Primo. And now the pass ahead. Here's Frost again. Cross the pass, Verby in front, Primo got most of it and is on the line and dug out of there by Kovacevic. Caden Primo, it's a little bit lucky here as Sealer put it underneath him. Kovacevic is there to grab it just before it goes over the line, right there. Good defensive play before Frost can get there to help it over. Farabee in the middle, tip it off of the right wing, D'Angelo. D'Angelo back for Farabee, tip behind him, trouble the other way. Moving up with it is Tierney. Tierney into the middle, but the shot off the goalpost. Enough to get the puck out to center. Gotten right back by Frost. He drops it, and now York up the middle on the money. Allison in on goal. Save Primo rebound. Comes back off of Primo out in front, but Suzuki is there. Across, Harris, a shot blocked out high. Sent on to the carom. Laurier kind of skated into him. They lost the puck. Huff and stopped in front by Sandstrom. Best assets or attributes for the shot right there, kind of squeezed between the pads of Sandstrom, bails out his teammates on that one. Hoffman does not miss from there very often. 13 goals this year for Hoffman. Bad injury issues, haven't all the Canadians except for Nick Suzuki, and they score! Bad turnover in front, and Gallagher gets his 201st NHL goal and ties this one at one. Ends up right on the stick of Gallagher. There's Lawton in the middle there. He gets hit up high. He's trying to grab it at the same time. I think Braun was involved as well. And that play just pokes to Brendan Gallagher and never stops working. Right there, you can see the mishandle after the hot. And the Flyers quite hard to recover the button. Fairby to the point. Responded across to Tippett. Tippett into the middle of D'Angelo. The shot up. Either Primo or Iron, and it goes out of play. I think it was off the crossbar. It didn't go. D'Angelo, he leans in and fires that wrist shot. It was glove of Primo and then the pipe. Lover's shoulder. Yeah. Did well to get a piece of it. And the Flyers that close to taking the lead here. And York. 
Frost to tries again. Nice fake right up the middle, knocked down. Puck was in a goal save. Net off its moorings, and play stops. And he is dangling in this one, isn't he? Look at that puck movement, outstanding move, and he is hooked up a little bit. There's a little tug on the shoulder as he went by, right there. That's a penalty that is often called. Morgan not complaining too much, but he has been on his game here, hasn't he? I think that would have counted. And they are both their friends. They yep. get along quite well. And uh, well, he did tell me I talked to him during the carnival. Don't chirp me. I think I just chirped him. Didn't Back out. Barron makes the move away from Farabee. Barron, the pass attempt blocked by the Flyers. Now Frost and Farabee the other way. Frost with the puck. Frost holds, waits, cuts to the middle shot. He scores! Artistry from Frost and a late lead for the Flyers. Two to one. Right there, blocks the shot. And then watch the acceleration by Frost. Do exactly what he was going to do with that puck. Fools two defenders and goes across the grain and fires it high to the glove side past Caden Primo. Just an outstanding individual effort with some help by Farabee who drove the net and pushed back those defenders along the way. As the Canadians try to tie it back up. Frost, drew on the draw. Frost knocked down, but the Flyers clear it out. Tippett bearing it on Matheson. Steals the puck, tipping it on goal. The empty netter. 3-1 Philadelphia. Tippett follows it up the ice. The high flip causes Matheson some difficulties. He tries to slide it across. Tippett steals it and skates it into the wide open net. Lost on the ice here, looking for one more. But chipped by Evans, knocked down by D'Angelo, and then Ulanin gets to it. 23 seconds. Sends it toward the net, and they score! Jumping on the garbage in front is Harvey Pinard. And all of a sudden, we had the goals that we told you would be coming. It's a 3-2 game with 22.4 seconds to go. Time left in this one. 22 seconds left. As the Canadians get the goal, Evans with a little bump pass. After that puck was knocked down on the way. By York, but the Canadians get to it, chip it over, and Harvey Pinard's got the goal. Puck down, Bates goes down, tries to occupy the puck. Has done that, they dig away, and time runs out in the hockey game. Learning his lesson from a game earlier this year when he tried to move the puck out. Cates gets it done, and the Flyers get the win.